Start seated on the ground. Bring one hand behind you. Press through the palm, through the shoulder, and lift everything up towards the ceiling. The opposite shoulder can stack on top of the supporting shoulder. Hold it for a few seconds and come down. Super important to let everything float up towards the ceiling. So really squeeze those glutes to lift the hips up, even lift the heels up all the way and come down. So look at it from the other side. I bring my hand under the shoulder, lift everything up, even through the heels as I go into the toes. Spend a few seconds there and come down. The opposite arm, again, it can dangle by the side or it can also float and reach all the way up towards the ceiling. It's not as important now. The main point is to find as much lift as possible. Here's a slightly more advanced version. I'm gonna start in a bear pose. Spiral one foot around on the ground and then find this one arm bridge as I float everything upwards. And I'm gonna reverse that. Hand comes down first, foot sweeps, and then the other side. I spiral, I open up to the ceiling, I reach, I float, and come down. You can notice really the spiral action. is goes foot first, then the upper body, float up, and then spiral down again, using the upper body first, then the legs. So as you go through this, really pay attention to this spiraling action of upper body, lower body, and vice versa. Let's take a look at it from another angle, where this time I show a slightly different variation where instead of reaching up with the free arm, I also reach behind me for some exploration of a space behind me. And this is what really translates well into a full bridge rotation later because eventually we can find a ground. But for now, just try reaching for the space behind you and come back down.